hello i will give you step by step the construction of pie cap pie cap is a thick concrete mat that sits on top of multiple pies to distribute the load from the superstructure evenly across the pies the construction of pie caps involves several stages first you do your site preparation surveying and marking on the pie positions then then, before beginning construction, the location of the pie caps is surveyed and marked. This includes ensuring the proper alignment and location of pies. Then the second is excavation. Excavate the area to require depth, typically just below the top of the pie. The depth will depend on the pie length and design specification. The next thing is to do your blinding to receive the form work. To give a uniform base for the form work. So you install the form work after installing the form work, then the form work has a good position alignment and to the pie cap position uh, size so that you will have the size of the pie cap we want to do. Then the next is to install your reinforcement. Your reinforcement still depends on your structural design. Install the steel reinforcement inside the Form work. This usually consists of mesh or free bar, vertical bars around the pie, and additional reinforcement as per the design. Then, after that, you do your concrete pouring. Then, mix concrete, prepare or other concrete according to the mix design, usually a high strength mix for pie caps. Pour the concrete into the form work, starting from one end. Working towards the other, ensure the concrete flow evenly around the pipe tops of the reinforcement. Usually, fabricators are used to make sure that it's evenly distributing the concrete around all the space of the pipe. It is essential that the ground beam we have to introduce into the pipe cap. After casting the pipe cap to halfway, Introduce the ground beam and also cast the ground beam and everywhere casted all together. After casting, they allow the concrete to set, then cure it for seven days. And after that, you do your. At this time, you have to do your filling and also do back filling. Then from there, you will not go ahead to do your thermal floor.